I work for a company that is doing a lot of damage in the world. Facebook and Google are no longer companies, they're countries. They must be stopped. <laughs> the government needs to step in and break up Google and Facebook. It's a better thing for the world. The single biggest thing is this company needs to be broken up. No king in the history of the world has been the ruler of two billion people. But Mark Zuckerberg is. Today, Satya Veritas undercover journalist have exposed another high-level executive at Facebook. I would break it up and I would remove Zuck as the CEO. So Mark Zuckerberg is very concerned with health. In fact, his uh, the Chan Zuckerberg oh, yeah. initiative. I'm fascinated and terrified at the same time. By Chris Berg, you should be. <laughs> it's a fight. It's 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 eugenics, uh, and I, I don't know any way to stop it. I think the genie is out of the box. This is why a lot of shit goes down because people aren't paying attention. I can I can target racist people using just those three uh, things. It's that easy. Because data is very powerful. Give me five things about you and I, I can pretty much figure out everything yeah. else. AI is essentially evolving to become like human intelligence and then it's going to go beyond human intelligence. And at that point, Humans are expendable. So it's not like the AI will try to like, kill us. They just won't care because they'll be. It'll be so superior that it'll be like these people don't matter. So I might be killing hundreds of ants when I walk in the park. I don't know and I don't care. Mm -hmm. It's not a thing that I think about. We will be like those ants. What if the <clears> tech <throat> companies like Google and Facebook remain unchecked? What is? Where do we go from there? What's going to happen? Deep shit. But what's going to happen? Bad things. We confronted Thomas, asked him to join our team of insiders. Here's what happened. I just want to let you know that I, I intend to release our conversations to the American people. You shouldn't do that. Are you interested in interviewing on the record with us to clarify your statements to the American people? No. Hello? Hey, Benny. Hang up the phone. We hope this story will encourage Thomas to change his mind and many others like him.